I tested eight natural antiperspirants, so you don't have to. This is my quest to balance my hormones. And for more information on why aluminium containing deodorant is a bad thing, I will link a few very intelligent, clever influencers. Go have a look at what they have to say. This video is not sponsored, and I had to go and find all these products myself, as well as pay for them. First up, we have Nivea. It's a naturally good green tea scented roll-on. Easy to find. Price point's pretty good. 25 Rand for 50 moles. But I didn't like the way it felt when I applied it. A little bit stingy, kind of like peppermint oil hitting your skin. So even though I love the fragrance, I probably wouldn't buy it again. Florian Garden. It is lavender and chamomile. This was lovely. It smells really good. Um, I thought it was a little bit pricey. 89 Rand for 80 moles. Um, I just think much better value to be had. But great brand. I love their shampoo. They do a rosemary shampoo that is fantastic. Clicks My Earth. This was like hunting unicorns. It has a wonderful, wonderful fragrance. Pineapple and geranium. It is delicious. You want to eat it. But just because it was so hard to find in the click stores, um, it was a bit of a hassle. I would use it. Um, I felt it didn't last as long as some of the other options on the list. But fragrance-wise, great. Price point, $29.99 for 50 moles. Not bad. These are amazing. They are a little bit expensive. Um, this one I got on takealot.com for 92 Rand. This had pick and pay for 99 Rand. But worth it. Especially in the beginning when I was still trying to figure this out. I stank. Oh, so fucking bad. And these would literally last an entire day. It has a really nice applicator. It's a cream. So it comes out the top there. Um, the only negative I have on this besides the price is that it does leave a slight residue. So you have to sort of figure out the application in the beginning um, because it will leave some marks on dark clothes. But fragrance wise, amazing. Amber and sandalwood, but this lime and eucalyptus is just to die for. So before everything started, I was using Sanex religiously. I've been a customer of theirs for many years. Um, the Zero initially I wasn't so chuffed with because I felt like it didn't last as long as the other ones that I liked. But once I, I figured out the right soap, these worked great. So at a $29.99 price point, um, 450 moles and they're super easy to find literally any store has them so these i think would be a really good everyday solution it's this has turned out to be the holy grail of natural deodorant it is by a brand called nature fresh um, which is local in south africa made in cape town and it's a lovely little cream look at that and it is so soothing when you apply it. So obviously not the greatest applicator because you're sticking your finger in a jar. But this has almost no fragrance to it. It just feels so great when you put it on your skin. Um, I have really sensitive skin, especially under my arms, weirdly. So this, I love it. And it leaves no residue, which I love. Um, which was my problem with the other other ones that I liked is that it had a the other creams had a residue. Um, this I ordered online. Um, you can go to their website, and they do amazing work. They believe in not um, spending money on marketing, but rather donating to charity. So the first week I stopped using mainstream deodorants with aluminium in them. I stunk so fucking bad. It was nasty my poor personal trainer. And then I read up a little bit and listened to some of the, the clever gurus and they recommended using a soap, special soap with benzoyl peroxide, which is the same stuff that's in your clearasil and oxytin for acne. Um, and to wash your armpits with that. 
Now, let me tell you, if you live in South Africa, you cannot find that soap. There's no way. So you can order it from Amazon. Um, the brand is Oxy10 and it makes a benzoyl peroxide bar of soap. And that is affordable. But the day that I pay 300 Rand for a little tube of face wash to use under my armpits, lock me up. So the best thing on the market is this. Again, nature's fresh. And I don't know why I didn't think of this sooner. This brand is amazing. So this can be used as a body wash or a shampoo. It has a beautiful, light, natural fragrance. And this stuff has been the game changer because now you can literally put anything on top of it and you will stay fresh all day. Um, I've been using other products in this brand for many years. They do, um, do, 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 do an intimate cleanser. Um, if that's something you need, uh, pH balanced, herbal, this stuff is great if you're prone to um, infections and things down there. And then we also use a lubricant that they make that is really fantastic. So I haven't bought anything else in many, many years. Um, can highly recommend all these products. And then the other interesting thing is to stop using face cloths or these scrunchy, it reminds you of a, of a veggie bag or something. Um, so I switched to something made from food grade silicone. You get several different options for these. Um, this one is called the Dewey. It was 199 Rand from takealot.com, comes in different colors. And the nice thing about this is you can um, pretty much clean it the way you can't necessarily clean those scrunchy things. It doesn't hold on to bacteria. Um, the fine bristles are really good for a nice gentle daily exfoliation. And the other side is actually really good if you want to massage sore muscles as well. Um, but it does give you a bit of a, a rougher scrub 